Hey, what's up, everybody? Chuck the Biz back again. Yes, dropping review after review after review. You know, yeah, I still don't got no fancy intros and editing, and you know, I do what I do. I upload it. I don't. I don't get in all that fancy stuff. Um, another one. Another one. Another one from Refining Fire Chilies. You can find them at superhotchilies.com or you can hit that with your smartphone. Uh, what we have here is the Pelso. This is a Hungarian paprika type. It's supposed to have mild heat. Uh, I will read this one a little bit. Sourced from Giza Korbli. He's a guy from Hungary who brought many pepper and tomato varieties into North America. So I'm going to tell you. The rest you can find out on the website, so you can check it out and maybe order you some seeds. Um, again, it's a creamy white color that's supposed to ripen till orange. Uh, it's not going to make it uh, till the to ripen till it's full color into my and you know it's I've had it for a minute and it's it's all it's going to do before it goes bad and I'm going to eat it before then. So. The Pelso, Hunger, another Hungarian paprika type. Okay, this has this one has a little bit of heat. Unlike the Alba, this one has some heat. It's not really hot. It's just it doesn't burn your mouth. It's enough to let you know that it's, it's got some meat. You know, it's like if you take a bite of something with, with a lot of black pepper in it, you're like, "Ooh, that's kind of hot." It's kind of like that. It's a thick, thick walled, very crunchy, very juicy, and you get the heat coming into the juices. It's wow. Very tasty and unique. Again, I'm loving, I'm loving these all these different varieties that I that you know that I'm able to sample that I that I never ever knew even existed. And you know, like I said, I I, I just recently you know not too long ago re uh, figured out that um. Paprika was was a was a pepper, you know, and, and, to, and to to go research it even more and to find out that there's even you know more than ten kinds of paprika that that go into it. it it's just phenomenal, you know. It's amazing and it's just uh, the the greatness of the pepper world. This pepper being a little larger, I could see it being stuffed with some you know some cheese. As another appetizer, because this one does have a little bit of heat, I could see this being stuffed with a little bit of some some kind of some kind of burger or some sausage with some cheese, and it would make a phenomenal popper. You know, wrap it up in some bacon and what have you. Again, it's a, it's another good one. I, I I really like this one because it's kind of just it's kind of it has the same kind of. A profile as 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 the Alba, but this one has some heat to it. And it, and it's a little bit bigger, and you can do some you know different things for it. You know, it's it's nice to have different peppers to do different things. So again, very enjoyable. Right there it is. I want you to go to that website, and I want you to check out all these new varieties, and you know, do you know there. Superhotchilies.com is a great place to go to learn about some chilies. Not just these chilies, you know, that you see. It, 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 there's a lot of information on that site about some other things. You know, Jim sells other other things besides chilies, but nice hub of information. That's why I, I, I that's why I don't I'm not reading everything that I, I want you to go see it. You know, I want you to go to go to it and explore and, uh, and and see what you can find. You know, it's just fun. I mean, you got online and you're looking for something to do, and you know that's what you can do. Go check it out. 
right there is refined fire chilies, superhotchilies.com. I'm Chuck the Biz, and yes, this is like my 500th polo shirt. And I say thanks for tuning in, and I will see you next time.